Hey everybody, it's time for Pillow Talk. Um, I apologize that I've been kind of slack getting back to you with Pillow Talk every week. It has been a long two weeks for me. Tonight I don't have a topic um, per se, but I just was going to share that I started my new job in June. And my office, I work for the district government, District of Columbia government. So they have the option where you can do um, alternative work schedules, which we call AWS. So basically you work longer days and you have a day off every other week. So I've had to adjust my schedule and um, get up like an hour earlier to go to work. I stay an hour later and I'm still teaching two nights a week so I have just been exhausted and I was telling my um, co-workers today like I just my I was running out of gas like <laughs> my engine was dying and I said I wish we could be like other countries um you know and I'm thinking Hispanic countries you know when I said this was you know, to have a siesta I wish the United States would make a mandatory siesta. Um, I think it would just recharge everybody if we had an hour or so a day just to do nothing but, you know, decompress, take a nap, just unwind, relax, whatever. It would do wonders. I think we, um, the United States, we just go, 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 you know, fast paced, overworked, you know, working these crazy hours a week, which just chips into our work-life balance. And we're just exhausted. And, um, you know, like I was met a um, friend for dinner tonight and I was just like, you know, thinking when I was younger, like on Friday night after dinner, it's like, okay, where are we going? We'll go to the movies. I didn't really do clubs. So you want to go to the movies? You want to go to somebody's house, watch movies? Like, what do you want to do? I had to shut the dinner down. Like, I was like, look here, I'm tired. I'm sleepy. Like, I want to go home and get in my bed. That's my idea of a fun Friday night now is relaxing and watching TV or just lounging until I fall asleep. It's just funny how, you know, when you're younger, you want to be out, out, out. I can't wait until I'm grown. And now that you're grown, you want to be home. and You want to just relax. So, it's just funny to think about that. So, um, I apologize, guys, that I have been bad about getting back to you all and doing Pillow Talk and Story Time. I will be back on track next week with the actual topic. It's just, like I said, I'm just so tired. Um, and I have a lot going on this weekend, too. But luckily, I have a massage planned. Um, so, that will help me as well. And I know I'm going to snore off the table tomorrow. But, hey. It is what it is. A good masseuse will put you to sleep. So, shout out to my girl Camille. Um, and what else did I want to kind of share with you guys? I guess that was really it. Um, like I said, I'm tired. As you know, oh, this is what I wanted to mention. I told my friend tonight at dinner. I told her, um, you know, it's funny. We there was a family sitting by us, and they had a little kid, probably about couldn't be more than a year, if a year. And the baby got frustrated and was crying. And I said, what if we as adults, when we get tired or we're frustrated, we just break out crying? Like, that would be hilarious. But that would have been me tonight. I would have been sitting at the table crying and pouting and having a meltdown because I was so tired and I was stuffed. And I really didn't eat a lot, but I just, you know, when you're just tired, you're not yourself. Like, I needed a Snickers because I was cranky. You know how the commercial is. But, you know, I can't enjoy my food and stuff if I'm really tired. And it just hit me all of a sudden. Like, I'm exhausted. I'm going to eat this salad. I'm going to eat some of this pasta. And the rest of it, I'm boxing up. We were at Olive Garden. So, you know, I wanted to eat all the bread sticks and the salad. But I just couldn't. I just All I could think about was finishing up what I had going to sleep. So, anyway, guys, have a wonderful weekend. I will come back next week. As you can see, I already got the mood set. It's dim lights. I got my soundscapes playing and I'm about to go to night night land. So you all have a good one and I'll talk to you next week on Pillow Talk. Good night. Sleep tight.